POE level 28. Is anyone... That's just... I, I'm going to you to leave. Okay, anyone else... Okay, does everyone else here want to do Prison of Elders? Yay or nay? Yay. I... Just regular... You just want to do 28. Level 28. Yeah, I need to get, I need to get some stuff. I only got one whole video up this week because of the way uh, the whole intro sequence to um, oh, what's it called? Metal Gear. It's copyrighted. The all video and all audio associated with it. So it took me like all week to figure out how to edit it so that I could get it up without setting off any alarms or getting in any trouble. <clears throat> Wow, wait, so the video that you're just... Now, I... Upload, the, the latest video is the video that they did that to? Yeah, so what I had to do is I had to cut the intro off, and then in my description on the video, I put a link to Konami's YouTube page where they have that intro. So that you can go click on it, watch the intro, which the intro is awesome, it's worth watching, and then I, I, I come back and play Ground mine. Zero. Yeah, Ground Zero is pretty fun. Yeah. Wait, wait. Did you see, like? Did you say, "Hey guys, I can't. I can put up the intro." I. Right, in, it's in my description. Okay. Well, I just noticed we all have the Roman. Head. I ain't got the Roman helmet. Things off in our, our helmet. I got a. I got like that fin on my head, but. No, no. You have the. Yeah, yeah. We have all three of us have the fins on our heads. Yeah, but you guys got a different helmet. Yeah, but I'm more badass. Now oh, this helmet's a lot more badass than that helmet. That helmet, I will give it this. It does look cool. I'm, yeah, st I'm still considering buying it. And my helmet's called the Eternal Warrior, man. You know, you know me. The yeah, Eternal Warrior. Don't go in there yet. Don't go in there yet. Don't go in there yet. Stop. Please, don't go in there yet. Please. Why? I'm doing something. Because I have that yearn from Crota that I'm trying to fill up. It's oh! Trying you can't to fill do it up. up here. Are you kidding me? Yeah, you can't do you can't, you can't, you can't, do, you can't do bounties here. Nothing yeah, nothing I'm counts towards tried. that stuff. Yeah, wow. I understand yeah. wanting to try, but yeah, you can't yeah, do I that tried, stuff I here. Tried. I tried on the other one I was doing when y'all when y'all first joined. Yeah, if you got like bounties to kill like a hundred guys without dying or something like that from uh, Vanguard, you can't get those done here either. Mine's from the Vanguard though. And mine is not, not from the Vanguard. It's from the. You can't chick. do any bounties. No bounties can be done here. Wow, that sucks. Yeah, it does suck. So are we? Which one are we doing tomorrow? The House of Wolves or the Crota? I would rather. I would rather get. Um, Dark Below done first. Cause, because, yeah, because I'm, I'm, I'm down either way, because I'm down to do both. I really care. Yeah, I've done it both. As long as I, like, I'll play. I'm down. Jesus. You can bust your fuck right now. I just don't know when I'm going to be able to get on here for sure tomorrow. I got to, you know, I got four kids. I got to oh. make supper and all that. But you have what? I got four kids, and I got to, you know, cook supper and... Got house chores to yeah, do and I stuff. Yeah, I know. I, well, I'm moving right now, so I won't be on the morning. Like, I'm helping my mom move because we got kicked out because uh. of our family problems. And yeah. uh, so, I mean, I'll still play because I'll, I'll be on, but not until like probably like I how I was on today, like after one or two maybe. I probably won't be on until after one or two okay. tomorrow. Well, right now it's almost 10 o'clock at night for me. Jesus. So you've got a time difference. It's 9. It's, it's nine. Where I am. Yeah, it, it's 6.45 where I am right now. Where are you, in California? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm in Ohio. You live where? South Carolina. South Carolina. So you're... you sh would you be in the same time zone as me? Your it's 9.45 here. Yeah, mine's 9.45 too. Okay. Yeah, you're in the same time zone I am then. 
That was fast. Yeah, yeah. Jesus. When you, when you got three, when you got three people, the first one that you do is always the easiest. You know, the first uh, room but that yeah, you run through. You have to fight a boss at the beginning. Now, on this, on level twenty-eight, you don't have to fight a boss. You just the first one yeah, is you always don't have easiest. To fight the boss at the beginning of this one. Yeah, well, yeah those I level thirty-two ones suck. Okay, it looks like we're going to the Vex next. Uh, they're not so bad when they're not the boss fight, but I hate it when they throw all those ultras and majors and shit at you. Yeah, I can't stand the freaking, what's it called? Uh, Hobgoblins. Yeah. Yeah, the way we almost got the uh, last part done is that we went all the way to the left. What in the world? These guys usually come out of this door, but they just teleported away this time. Probably because I was waiting on them. They don't like that shit. After this, I gotta do, I gotta do some trials. Osiris. Uh, will you, are you, are you still gonna play after that? Yeah, this dude just wants me to play some trials. Uh, you, you, you wanna hit me up after you're done with the trials, or? Yeah, sure, I guess, I will. Alright, so I'll probably just play playing in the, this, since I'm gonna be playing the House of Wolves campaign with, uh, Echelon. I was yeah. planning on doing that, but now I'm not going to, because I'm going to be doing it with him. What? Seeing any more bad guys around. We killed them all. We are bad. Be enforcements ready for combat. I just thought so sorry you, you had to scrap like four or five videos, man. That's alright. That's how it goes. Making one right now, or yeah, I'm recording this. I'm good. Damn it, I'm gonna record yeah, something tonight. I am gonna record something tonight. Damn it. Four or five videos. I mean, like. Okay, kill the guy with the big red star. He's trying. Shot at the right now. He's dead. Okay. Yeah. You have done it. Alright, now we just gotta mop up the rest of this shit. I don't see how they, they, they get, like, they don't get slow when they're in these uh, little areas, the white area. Right? Oh, well, it's, yeah, it only affects yeah. us. Those, those weird mine things, they only affect the players, yeah. they don't affect the bad guys. You, you know, you know what I, I wish they would have, uh... Let you choose the lightness or the darkness. I'll take it. You feel me? Yeah, I know what like, you're saying. Like if you, like if you want to be part of the dark side, you can. Like the darkness. Yeah. It's like, I mean, being part of the the light side is okay, but I mean, like, what if I want to be part of the dark side? You feel me? Yeah. Like, Empire that that Empire. might actually become a choice later in the game. Uh, that would be cool. Not not this next uh, DLC. But I was watching a thing, they were talking about the original story of this was actually, uh, the speaker was a bad guy, and so was the traveler, and you come across information that reveals that to you, so you end up making a choice at, to fight against the traveler, and you lose your ghost, and to other people in the city you appear to be a bad guy, but in reality you're the good guy, you know what I mean? And then they they change that. I would totally, I would fight with the speaker. I would be like, yes, let's dance. Uh, then they they changed like they changed it, and now they're talking about making it. The, it's possible in one of the DLCs that the story may come back to that. 
yellow pick. Which I think that would be cool. Be, I would I would be down for that. Yeah, I'd you, be down for that. You could choose the fight against the traveler because supposedly the traveler intentionally created the darkness and that's what wiped out humanity. And yeah. it intentionally brought the darkness to Earth. And so it's the bad guy. And um cool with that dude and leave Bungie. Yeah. Because yep. that would have been an alternate ending. Yeah, there was a, one of the lead writers for him. Yeah. Uh, when he left, yeah. when, when he wrote that part in, he ended up leaving and then they threw it out. But they were talking about they might go back to that. And another one they might go back to is, uh, what was it? It was, uh, oh, uh, Rasputin, the war mind, is actually the traveler who time traveled back to try to uh, stop the end of the human race or stop the end of all life in the solar system. And Rasputin? At, oh, the Warmind guy? Yeah. Yeah, and that Rasputin is actually the Traveler, but from an alternate future or something. And that the uh, the Black Heart of the Black Garden took mercy on him and showed him how to do what he wanted to do to save humanity. That was one of the theories that they were talking about. And it, that one actually sounded pretty interesting, too. Yeah, that would be interesting. Jeez, that would be... That would be a cool story. Like, you know how in the speaker's room, there's uh, that machine, and if you look around it, there's like seven tiny galaxies or universes trapped inside glass jars. Yeah. It, it was talking about that Rasputin, the speaker, and uh, and uh, the stranger all know the truth, and that this is like the seventh or eighth time that they've tried to save humanity from the darkness. And... Wow. That that's what those other universes are in the little jars. That's like those are like uh, what you call it. Those are other chances. yeah. They're studying like what ha what went wrong in the other All ones and the other universes, so that it won't happen again in this one. Must be I like that idea, but the only one, the only reason why I like the other idea is because I like Star Trek side. Like I played yeah. um. I like, like in Star Wars, if I can go dark side, I always go dark side. Yeah. Like, I'm never light side. I hate the rebels. And, like, I hate the the Republic and the old, old, Knights of the Old Republic and freaking the game online MMO and shit. I hate, yeah. I hate those guys. Now, see, the one thing that I do like about the Jedi is they got they got they got better lightsabers. They got more variety. You know, red gets boring. Unless it's your favorite color. I guess it wouldn't be. We got to disarm these mines. Well, you can have a black, man. There's black and shit. Yeah. Uh well, uh, that's uh what is the name of that game? Uh the Force Unleashed. It's like a Star Wars Force Unleashed, you can get the black lightsaber if you found it. I'm going to need one more person over here to disarm this in time, because I've only got ten seconds I am, left. I'm coming. Coming. We're all here. Okay, we got it. Success. Yeah, but I think that would be cool. See, and... I don't know. We'll have to just wait and see what the other DLCs bring. I like the war... Yeah, I like the war mine idea, though. I really do like that one. Like, if they go with that one, I would be perfectly fine. Yeah, that'd be cool. I kind of, I don't like the speaker. I kind of, I'm suspicious of him to begin with. Why? There's something about him that sets something off in my brain that says I do not like him. Wait, why do you like him? You never, you don't know anything about him except that he's like... The speaker of the traveler is all you know. Yeah, I... The leader. There's, so why I, does that make him a bad guy? I, I don't trust him. I, and something else to keep in mind, too, is uh, you know how the game starts. You're dead, and then they resurrect you. Everything that's fighting for the Traveler is basically an army of the undead. And we're, Warlock is an evil term for an evil magic user, and that's one yeah. of them. Titans were evil in Greek mythology. Yeah, Titans were and then the Hunters are just... Hunter could be an an evil thing if like it means like the hunter of another sentient being or a living or like a person but hunter doesn't necessarily have to be evil it can you know that's debatable 
Yeah, Hunter can decimate a but the Titans were bad. Yeah, they were bad in Greek mythology. And... They were the guys who brought upon the apocalypse. And we basically were an army of the undead named after evil things from history. Yeah, so... But you, I don't think the... the so we might the be the bad guys. That. We might be the bad guys. And not even know it. I don't think we're the bad guys. Don't, don't pull that. I don't think we're the bad guys. I don't know. You, know what? you really I, think we're I, the bad guys? Know. But you know what would suck? The fallen, the fallen are actually bad because if you read, if you read the uh, Grim more cards, Grim more cards, yeah. From uh, Barrett, you he actually they uh, he said something about like why does you know how the Vex have their god, the the Cabal, you know, so they have their stuff and their great war and machine god stuff, in. and you know humans have the travelers. And what? <clears throat> I was in my voice, but what does the what does the fallen have? They have nothing. Mm-hmm. And Barrett is all talking about, you know, why don't we ever have anything and stuff like that? And it's what keeps going on about, you know. Well, technically, their god. Well, I don't know if the Kel of Kells is their god. It's their like Messiah, I guess you could say. The Kelly Kells is like a king. The prophet, king. yeah. The emperor of the fallen. A legend. The 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 Kells of prophecy is like Kelly Kells. But what's his name? He calls he typically. It was weird when I when I completed it because he's talking about how he's the Kells of Kells, and he, he typically just promoted himself. Yeah. He, he promoted himself. And to be honest. He actually did more than any other any of the other kills ever did. Oh, Barrett? No. I know he's talking about oh, the guy at the end of House of Wolves. What is his name? Yeah. Oh, oh. That, no, that I guy. I can't remember. I can't think of his name off the top of my head. I should. I mean, we were just talking about it not too long ago. But you know what would suck. Yeah. Think about it, if you were actually just, a guardian. I just don't see us as the bad guy. If you were actually the guardians, though, do you know what would suck about it? All the times you get killed, you know, being shot over and over has to hurt, and then you get blown up, you get burned, you die a lot. But they never let you stay dead. They always bring you back. Do you know what kind of PTSD you would have after being murdered you hundreds and hundreds of times, and so they never let you stay up. dead? PTSD like crazy, dude. You'd be like, I'm, I'm like, yeah. I'm in my mind. And any creature that would keep you in perpetual servitude probably isn't a good guy. Because they keep you in perpetual servitude. Even when you die, they just bring your ass back. You're not allowed to be dead. Yeah, they're like, why would we let this guy be dead? Fuck off. Yeah, there's so no peace in death. We are the bad men. I think that's quite possible. Well, what, if is, what if, what if the, uh, secret is bad, but we just don't know it yet? Like, where the thing is... I mean, we're... The, the individual well, guardians I'm aren't... fine with being the bad guy. The, I don't think that the, uh, individual, um, guardians are actually bad guys. But I think their leadership yeah. is. Yeah, what if, like, the speaker is bad, and, you know, the guardians don't know it? There's all their life, like, there's a time they've been told that the speaker is a good guy. Yeah, they've been told that the speaker is their leader and crap. You know, at the end of the game, he talks for you, too, so it's like, why not believe it? And everybody loves him and shit. The Vanguard leaders listen to him. Yeah. Like, everyone listens to him, but, like, do they know that he's actually, like, actually, like, good? I, he doesn't even reveal his face. You don't know if he's an Exo, uh, an Awoken, or a human. Well, for all you know, he could be a uh, fallen with his arms trimmed, like the uh, those one guys, the low-ranking fallen. Yeah, you have no idea what he is under that weird, all-consuming face-covering mask. The mask, the mask, the, gl the grimoire card, the mask. Dang it! He hit me with the shield, but the, the mask is actually a connection to the traveler. Like when he puts the mask on, yeah, he he typically controls the traveler. That's what the grimoire. That's what I read from the grimoire card. Like his. When he puts the so he controls the, the traveler? 
Yeah, he has a connection to the traveler who puts the mask on. The mask was created by the traveler. How do we know that the mask wow. doesn't control the traveler? Mm -hmm. I, there's, I don't trust the speaker. I have, I have not an ounce of trust for the speaker at all. So I don't necessarily believe what he says. You think he could be a fallen under that? He could be, or he could be the darkness itself for all I know. Maybe the. He could be the the creator of the darkness. He could be, and he could be controlling the traveler to keep it from helping us. You know what I mean? Or something. I. The Traveler might be alright, but I definitely don't trust the Speaker. You know what's funny? It's what? I'm gonna laugh about, so what? Don't trust the speaker. Watch it turn out to be that the Traveler is a bad guy, but the Speaker is actually the good guy. That's a possibility. But I wouldn't bet money on it. Because what if the Traveler... Yeah, yeah, well that could be. What if the Traveler is the bad guy, and the Speaker is just following his orders, because that's what the traveler is telling him to do. But really, the traveler is the creator of the darkness, just creating them all, and the speaker is just trying to get us all to kill him. But he can't because the traveler keeps spawning him, spawning him, spawning him. Well, the traveler actually <laughs> brought the darkness to us. The yeah, traveler, the darkness the followed. The darkness is take, is trying to take the traveler, and it it wants it. Brought it, I can't talk right now. It led it to us. Yeah, it, yeah, typically so. It just kind of killed us. It destroyed the entire human, human race. Before half of it. I don't know. I, I, you. I don't, and have you noticed that the fallen, they're, uh, what you call it? Their their servitors seem to. F I don't. I know it's they're all ball shaped and all that. I, it seems that their technology and their servitors might be based off of the follower or not the follower, the traveler. Just the same way the ghosts are kind of like mini servitors. That's what they kind of look like. What if the traveler helped the fallen achieve their technological superiority? And then let the darkness destroy them. And then it went on to look for a new race, us. And then it led the darkness to us. And then... Wiped out the human race. Then the Fallen came here, and the Fallen hate the Traveler. Maybe that's why they hate the Travelers, because it destroyed... It's responsible for the destruction of their home world, too. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that would make sense. This one's my favorite. I don't know why. I hate this guy. This is probably one of the harder bosses in the prison, the basic prison of elders. And not that he's that hard, but he's got all these freaking uh, ultra guys with shields. Yeah, true. I don't know why this one just seems... It's not that it's hard, or it's not easy. It just seems, feels easy, because I just like hide behind that one wall. Like, every time I play this one, no one leaves that one wall. They're always right here. There's really not many places you can go out here that you could hide. You know what I mean? That's why everyone sticks right in this area. You need shelter, like, when your shield goes down. And this is, like, the only place you can really get that. Yeah, and it's... The outline of the wall is bigger than all the other areas that you start off with. There he is. We have to complete this fast, it's just the sisters making me go outside right now. Okay, well, let's get this I done as know. fast as we can. Yeah, she's saying his mom told us to, but I know his mom is not making us. Because we've been outside all day, she's making us go outside. She does this all the time. What is she, um, your babysitter or something? No, 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 Savannah's five. We're babysitting her, that's why we have to go outside. Oh, that makes no sense to me. I'd be, if I was babysitting her and she was five, she would be sitting on the couch next to me and that's just how that would work. You know what I mean? I'm not going outside. We only have to go outside because his mom tells us to. Because she wants to go outside. But uh, she, 
He wants to jump on the trampoline every time we go outside, and I'm just gonna sit there and be like, fuck out. Well, tell her to give you just a couple minutes, son. That's what I did, so I was just like, come on, we gotta finish this right now. Right. If I don't die on this, I hope I get something good, because I really just want legendary RPGs. I ain't even got a key right now. Yeah, I'm hoping to get a, I'm hoping to get a key from one of the small chests when we go open them up. I got a key. What was it? The lady, the lady. I did all the the oh, what's it called? Bounty. Yeah. And she didn't give me anything. Really? Usually every every single time I turn in uh, my first bounty of the week for her, I always get a key. Every time. She did give you like a double XP for everything. Yeah, they gave me an XP and that was it. Like they gave me um. A bonus for the queen's grass. Oh my! God. My health is so low. It's not even funny. Sorry, I, I, there was ammo down there. That's fine. Let's get this dude dead. I gotta take my brother's dishes out. Gotta take his dishes out. Yeah, he, he left food trade. He did! Nice. Good. Yeah! Let's go. I got a network key. Whatever so I did I. You turn it into a crypt arc for like two or three hundred uh, glimmer. Go give it to a crypt arc and he'll give you something for it. Dang, I got four kills. Alright, whoever gets to the bottom first, wait for everyone else to join you before you open up any of the chests. Because it, it starts a timer. Treasure awaits in Crystal Barrow. What's all the bones here? Oh. Yeah, I'm right behind you. All right, you can go ahead and open. We dance. We we dance. Open it up like it's Christmas morning. We we open it. Okay. I think we open it up together. Wow, I got her right hand again. Hey, I got a key for the big chest. Hey, I got some good shit. What is that? Payments? I got a, a new legendary rifle called Payment. I got her right hand again. Um, it's a pulse rifle called Payment. That'd be six. Payment six. Okay. Did you say Payment Diabetes six? No, Payment six. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna lay in with all this blue glimmer thing. I don't know what it looks yeah, like. Yeah, I got, I got one of those big glimmer crystal things, too. Hitman was kicking ass in that round. And I got another legendary. I got a Rain Master 4 and a helmet that I do not need. Alright, I'm just gonna leave, go turn everything in, and then I'm gonna go outside. Alright. Yeah. I'll talk to you guys later. And uh, Ice Code, hit me with a uh, friend request. And oh, yeah. that's you, I'll, 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 I'll just do it. you better be on tomorrow. I'll try to be on sometime tomorrow. Yeah, I'll send you the turn request. Alright. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna Alright. Uh, I'll, I'll hit you up when I'm back on, uh, Ice. Okay. What time are you saying? Oh, hopefully. Huh? Hopefully. I'm hoping I get it. Yeah, I'll get this edited and I'll get this up Never mind. tomorrow I'll by noon. Well, yeah, I'll hit you back when I come back because I'm about to have, we're about to have dinner. Okay. Uh, ice. S1? Yes. Better be on. I'll try to be on tomorrow. Or, or you're going to have like a million comments on one of your videos. <laughs> I, that's fine. I don't get hardly any comments on my videos. That'll help. I'll, be like, S1, uh, I'll comment on how the video was bad, good, and okay. <laughs> huh? I'll see y'all later. Uh, you Alright guys. In here.
All right, so two of my friends want me to do a video first level of Prison of Elders with them. That's exactly what that was. Uh, so we actually were doing Nightfall and it got all screwed up. We tried doing the Crota run, but everyone got kicked out. So they're like, well, we want to do something. We want to be in a video. So I was like, okay. I suggested Prison of Elders and that's where we went. I'm just going to the tower now to get some of my stuff decrypted by the Crypt Arc, and then that will be the end of this. I want to see what I got. Looks like I had some good stuff. Oh. Network keys, axiomatic uh, beads, or whatever they're called. Arma engine DOA. I'll have to take a look at that. And Violator 12? I already got one of those. And my vault. Um. Payment, the shadow. I'm going to go ahead and tear that down. I already got one in my vault. Arma Engine DOA. 33 Magazine. Let's take a look at this. I've never heard of this one. Ah, I like it. It's nice looking. I'll probably hold on to this. I'll probably throw that in my vault see if any of my other characters need one. I've still got the Deviant A from way back when you still needed Ascendant Energy and all that upgrade your here's what I can do make that my weapon and then I'm going to compare arm engine has less impact less stability and it's slower on the reload so I'll definitely be keeping deviant A go ahead and throw the ash factory up All right, well, that's going to be it for this. If you guys liked, let me know. Leave a comment. I plan on recording the other, um, the other Prison of Elders as I go through them. I have to go through the last one and kill, uh, what's his name? Skolas, that's his name, the guy that's head of the wolves. I still got to kill Skolas. I got to do Vault of Glass and kill Atheon on hard. I've killed him on regular, I need to kill him on hard, and I need to kill Crota on hard, and I'll have done everything needed for the uh, year one awards, the year one player awards that people will be getting. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go to Bungie.com, uh, get an account, log in with your information from either your PlayStation or your Xbox, your uh, gamer tag, log into that, and then Look at your profile and look at Moments of Triumph. There will be a wheel with 10 points on it. And if you get every single point on it filled, then in a, what, a month and 28 days or 27 days, they're going to be giving away year one awards. It's basically just a nameplate. From what I understand, it's a nameplate that's going to be exclusive to people that got all this stuff done in the first year that the game was out. Uh, I'm not going to cry if I don't get it, but since I'm only three things away from it, I'm going to try for it. Though, whether or not I can get a good enough strike team together to actually go do those three things is another story. I got a lot of friends who play, but several of them aren't great. I'm not the greatest player, but several of them that I play with aren't great. I like to play with them. But I'm going to need to figure out which one of my friends are the best. Um, wait a minute. I'm going to compare that to... No, I'm keeping all fate. And... Throw that in. So I need to figure out which ones of my friends are the best to play with to get those three things done. Alright, well, if you guys liked, let me know. Leave a comment. Hit the like button. 
Um, I recently went over a hundred subscribers, so that's a yay for my 250th video. I'm going to probably try to put together something special. So, alright guys, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.